54 Knights RV. Today we're doing a really quick walkthrough of a Dolphin Cape Cod. It's a 2019 model. Um, it's Mercedes uh, chassis. And this is a luxury Class B. Um, you can see it by all the shininess. Those cup holders right there. Um, kind of useless. <laughs> yeah, just right next to not worth being there. And oh wait, there's something to pull. Yeah, uh, yeah. Terry has to pull on it. Just nothing happens, thankfully. <laughs> It's fun when something happens. It's all the stitching on there. I mean, this is just an upscale um, Class B van. Of course, $145,000 is what they're asking for it at this show. So, Lots of shiny. And it's a Class B, so things are going to be tight. There's, you know, you got your sink and you got the high dollar lighting controls and induction cooktop that back seat is an electron is electronic so it folds down to a bed electronically and more controls over there it's yeah. pretty fancy for a little space a little post hole for a table which is hidden in the storage up above the bed Let's see there's a decent amount of storage for a Class B van. There's where the table's stored. And probably have to find a different place to stow that because that's a good sized storage area for something else. You got plenty of space back here behind the seat. Toss in some inflatable kayaks or paddle boards and you can probably get a zipper screen back there you usually can yeah. I'm sure you can for the Mercedes and you got this this is awesome it's surveillance cameras on the van so you know if you're boondocking in a Walmart or even just parked beside the street you can flip them cameras on and be able to see what's going on around here and then you flip your machine Vehicle. guns if there's somebody back there that's being I don't think this bad. one came with the machine guns. Oh, it's an option? That that would raise it another 100000 Okay. And you got your uh, all-in-one shower and bathroom area. And it's tiny, but it's a van. So, I mean, that's what you're going to get in, in these Class Bs is something tiny. But it's serviceable, so... Yeah. Little bitty microwave, but there's a microwave. And there's nothing wrong with being able to potty and yeah. shower at the same now time. And this one has a generator on it. I, really, you're going to distract me with that <laughs> comment. This one actually has a generator. It's a, I believe it's a 1.5 kilowatt or 2.5 kilowatt propane generator. It's nice. I mean, all dressed up and prettied. It's a Class B, not something that I'm not sure that I could deal with even well, if I was all by myself. You know, many houses are all the rage, and I think part of the reason they're all the rage is because it's kind of amazing how they can make a small space work. It really yeah. is. No, and there, but there's... You're, but you're still you're still going to have a lot less storage, a lot less living. You really need to like the person that you're hanging out with. <laughs> but uh, on just from the viewpoint of Class Bs, this thing is all pretty and shiny. But honestly, I've seen uh, better laid out, um, better outfitted. I mean, it, but it does have a generator, which is something that you don't always see on these class B's um, and it's got the cameras got the cameras that's nice it's okay I'm... 
I don't know that I would get it, but I don't know that I wouldn't get it. I mean, it's it's okay. Yeah. Um. Anyway, that was a really quick walk through. It has through to be quick a, on a bee. <laughs> If you like it, give us a thumbs up. If you like the walkthrough, give yeah. us a thumbs up. I don't care if you like the van. <laughs> um, take a gander at the rest of our content on 54 Nights RV. And if it's something you like, hit the subscribe button. I'd like to have you along for the ride. We will uh, catch you on the next round. <laughs>